don't really know what to do, but in this point, he's left alone to die. Paul James. Paul James Whip Brown. Bye bye, Fee, of course, as well. Jesus. Jesus Christ. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. And Paul Abbey as well. Yeah. I'm speechless. I was shocked as well. Candice Taylor was good again. Brilliant as well. So yeah. So. On to the episode. Uh, review. I mean. Um, so yeah. V takes matters uh, into our own hands. The Carters remain hell bent. Oh God, hell bent, Jesus. Um, on secure their future. Benedict, please, with Candice for help. So. So yes. Um, yeah, V takes uh, matters on his own hands. So uh, on our own hands um, to ask hey, her uncle to sign the lease of the company, of course, give back the calf to Kathy and pay and the um, Carters have to pay to get the pub back. Yeah. Which was that? Oh, damn. Jesus. Shit me. Shit me. But yeah, um, yeah, the Carters, um, yeah. Before that, um, yeah, Fee um, takes the uh, matters to her own hands. She visits her father, James, in the hospital and then says wave goodbye um, to Max, of course. Oh, Gluck, Gluck, um, to yeah, them two. And yeah, waves goodbye to Wal um, Walford. It's been a pleasure. Literally, it's been a pleasure watching um, Fee... Yeah, it's been a pleasure. It's been a pleasure. Um, yeah. Yeah, it it was. It's been a pleasure. Um, yeah. It's been a pleasure um, of Fee saying goodbye, of course. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I feel sorry, actually. Yeah, Lisa um, Falkyrie. Um, it's been a pleasure um, watching you on the show. On the show, and yeah. Uh, what's going on? I'm reviewing. Sorry. Yeah, it's been a pleasure um, watching you on the show um, for months on the show, and yeah, it's been a pleasure um, watching you. Um, good luck in the future um, of on TV or film, and yeah, hope you, I hope I see you, and I hope you will return in the future in EastEnders and hopefully hopefully and yeah um yeah that was that was sho a shocking shocking twist so um yeah a shocking twist a shocking twist it was it was it was a shocking twist It was. It was really a shocking twist that <coughs> people left. So yeah, um, and so yeah, but James Whit Brown, um, um, left alone to die. I was like, what? Yeah. So, um, sorry guys. Uh, 
Next up, yes, Max um, gets a call to the hospital to um, to the doctor that I was telling you to is gone now. Um, that um, Abby is brain dead, so she can't wake up. When I yeah, it was a shock. So yeah, that's the end of Abby, Abby and Brannon. So. Bye bye Abby. Um don't know when she's gonna exit. But yeah. Bye bye Abby. Um so yeah. That was a shock for Max of course. Um don't know when Lauren is gonna exit. Um probably the same way, um, in hospital, die in hospital, um, same way as Abby, probably. Um but yeah, we'll find out. Um so yeah, the Stacy and Martin have a row of um, yeah what's gonna happen to them, of course. And Martin has a think and hands out hands out with hands out with um, uh, with Ted, of course. And then Stacy goes as well. I was like. Like, literally, I can't keep keep up. Um, yeah, Stacy goes, leaves, and Martin. Martin um, comes back home. Yeah, yeah, comes back home. Um, see a note from Stacy, and yeah, he's she um, goes to. Um, <clears throat> Goes to um, goes um, to her mum's, of course, and yeah, I know she's coming back. Stacey will come back. Is returning, of course, with um, Mo, Jean, and um, Cat, of course, and yeah. Damn, Stacey's left as well. It's left Wolfwood. She can't come back. She can't go back, and what she's done sleeping with Max but yeah um but yeah Martin did t take it too far uh what he said and that and so yeah he did he did really really did and so yeah um the Taylors yes Keanu uh, makes a deal um tries to um well spend all his money from his nan and yeah um do scratch cards um, Karen and Keegan. Bernadette pleads for help from Candice, of course. And yeah, yeah, and he, she does, she does um, help. But yeah, they had um, quiet 29 minutes and she, he only got a tenner. Well done, Keanu. Well done, well done. Yeah, um, which was like, oh God, what are they going to do now? And then Candice turns up with the grants. And then they have an argument again. Of course, Candice and Karen have an argument. Sisters always. Sisters always. I live with them. And one's in Bognor. So, uh, um, um, yeah, one is lives away. So, yeah. Yep. Great lot. Yeah. They argue a lot. I've got, a sister. I've got two sisters. They argue a lot when they come... And the other one comes down. It's very, very hard. But yeah, um, they always they have a sis, um, family laugh, of course. And yeah, yeah, they do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, um, tonight's episode was really shocking, brilliant, fantastic, brilliant story development, brilliant character development in this episode as well. And yeah, can't wait for tomorrow. EastEnders continues tomorrow at 8 o'clock on BBC One. Don't miss it, guys. It's going to be a whopper one. Because it's heist time. Yes, it is. It's heist. It's heist time. And yeah, with Phil, Vincent, Andy, and Mick. So yeah, get ready for Andy's. Angels.
something like that. But yeah. So, I'm going to give this episode 9.3 out of 10 because it was a really, really good episode and enjoyable and fantastic. So, hope you enjoyed this with you guys. Give this a big thumbs up. Comment down below what you thought of um, tonight's Eastern, um, second half. Click the subscribe button if you're new around here, guys. Click the bell button if you get notifications when you upload. When I upload. And keep on subscribing to my channel, Not So Funny Comedian, of reviews, sketches, and more. And see you tomorrow for um, new stuff. New, new, new stuff. Like reviews, all that stuff. Keep on subscribing to my channel and see you tomorrow. Goodbye, guys. Hope you enjoyed my reviews today and keep on subscribing. Goodbye. Keep on subscribing to my channel. Goodbye. Bye, guys. Hold on. Keep on subscribing. EastEnders continues tomorrow at 8 o'clock on BBC One. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Goodbye, guys.